Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Drayton Manor and more importantly my channel. Well, is it more important? I don't know. Anyway, we are now on episode 11 of building Drayton Manor in Planet Coaster. And what's that sound I hear? Yes, that is the Thomas the Tank Engine theme song playing on the Thomas Land speakers. But back to the video. So we are kind of screwed. And how are you going to get out of debt? Well, that's how we are. We are going to be selling more stuff. We need to add in more shops. Sell more useless games that they usually do. Do like throw the ring around the bottle, stuff like that. And maybe you'll take the 2% chance that you will get a gigantic Charmander Teddy. But you may be wondering, huh, Dan? What if you rebuilt that shockwave station again? Well, I did. And it's just as realistic as it was before, but you know, we move. But it is now time for another time lapse. And in this time lapse, I'm rebuilding something that I did build a couple of episodes back, and that is the chicken diner dinner, whatever. So I started off by adding in the walls that go around this roof, actually, but the walls and the roof that go around the outside of the diner at the sort of bottom of the diner there's a little bit that's more shallow and then above that base layer there's a bit of roof that gets even steeper which you may see in the clip as I advance and this is the sort of bit of roof that goes above and it gives the roof room to do roof stuff and that is the bit of steeper roof that I was talking about I'm using the wooden sort of roof because it gives me all sorts of options of different shapes of roof to use and then I can also use all of the different colours and the pattern is not that bad so that is a good tip for anyone that wants to kind of get good at Planet Coaster. And I'm just filling in that back wall quick. And then there's some pillars that go around the outside of the restaurant. And this is what I'm adding in at the minute. And between all of the pillars, there is a bit of picket fence. And that's what I'm adding now. When it gets to the corners, it goes all the way around the outside, but it gives you a bit of space to walk through if you actually want to buy any of the chicken. I chose to put the uh, Tiki Tiki sort of cafe in there for the guests to use and spend all their money on. This next thing I'm adding in now is the toy shop. And this toy shop is located down by the zoo. Uh, bit close to Accelerator and the Humble Pie and Mash restaurant. Right now I'm just adding in the signs. I've decided to double up the signs so then the placement looks alright on the wall. The actual sign IRL has little teddy bears on it and stuff symbolising the different toys that you can get. Obviously I'm just using a just a memento but, but something that Frontier should add to Planet Coaster is an option for more types of shop. Obviously there was other sort of food shops that came in all of the DLCs. However, there aren't any gift shops other than the free that you get in the main game. So Frontier, if you are watching this, which you probably aren't, please do add more types of shop to the game, like gift shops. Because something that sells goodie bags is hardly a good uh, gift shop for toys. I haven't really done much work on this main street down by the zoo. I haven't done any work on the zoo altogether. Maybe I should make a start on that for next episode. Because it's just that entire half of the park that I have barely touched. If you think about it, Drake Manor is kind of split into four. You've got the opposite sides of the lake, and you've got Thomasland, and then there's a zoo. 
and I haven't done anything with the zoo. So maybe a start that I could do is add the paths around. Obviously the zoo would be very, very boring because the unlike Rollercoaster Tycoon, where you'd be able to add the animals from the zoo into the main game, Planet Zoo is completely separate to Planet Coaster. And same goes with water parks. I feel like the next sort of thing that we would see from that sort of franchise would be a planet water slide or something. And suddenly the Holy Trinity will be complete. But something that I did find pretty funny was that when I placed down all of these shops, all of the vendors inside of the shops all started moving at the exact same time. I'm not sure if this is a glitch or if I just have impeccable timing, but I think this is quite amusing, to say the least. But these vendors, they do need a building to be serving from, and that is this building here. I made the main shell or structure of the building off camera, but right now I'm adding in the main sort of veranda that goes on the top of it. Sort of gives some cover if anybody's like queuing up to be able to use the sweet shop and stuff. Because this building is a sweet shop. I don't think I've actually been to this sweet shop before. But I've seen people that have just around the park. Uh, do you know those like things that you fill up with the hundreds and thousands? I'm going to recall them selling a lot of them there. And here there's like some stripy poles that go down the side. And I've decided to use like a traffic light thing to show the poles and stuff. So some advice for anybody that is playing Planet Coaster now due to the console release or if you're just new to the game in general. Don't leave your buildings to be 2D because nobody likes a square 2D building. But my next mission now is to add music to these vendors because somehow they are just still all in the same time as each other other than one on the right because one on the right, you know, we, we don't like the one on the right. So let's have a flick through through some of the songs that I could add to get these guys to dance to. You know, I reckon this song's pretty good for them to all spend the rest of their lives dancing to. Unless if one of them ends their shifts, in which they'd all end their shifts at the same time, realise that they can't all fit into the same building, and then finally they will be lifted of this curse of forever being in the same cycle.